Come with me for a quick walk around tour on this Larson 290 Cabriolet Express Cruiser here at South Mountain Yachts. She's at model year 2000 and she's very well powered with twin Volvo engines. Starting here at the bow, we have what I call an LLI, ladies like it feature. That whole area is set up for an oversized sun pad to lay out on, enjoy the book, enjoy the day. Here at the bow, part of the working of the vessel, we've got a windlass with foot pedals right here and then a spotlight for easy nighttime docking. Coming down along the side, we see we've got nice grab rails all the way around dual trumpet horns, centerline walkthrough on that windshield. Got a nice tailor curved tinted windshield right here to give it that sleek sporty look. Moving aft at the radar arch we have all of our antennas there including the radar unit. We have dual bimini's on this vessel and for off-season use we, there's a full enclosure. There's also a cockpit cover to offer lots more protection. Here at the transom we've got our weaver snap davits. You can see there's a dinghy, hard bottom dinghy with vessel. There's a boarding ladder, easy access from the water. And then here at the transom, we've got lots of storage. We'll call it trunk storage. And then off in this corner, we've got our water fill and hot and cold shower. We enter the vessel through the starboard door right here and immediately we see we've got our seating area. There's an in-deck floor mount for the table which is stored down below. We've got a wet bar back here with a refrigerator. Moving down the port side. Another feature, there's loads of storage here. And then access to the bow on this Larson Cabrio is nice and easy. We've got formed in fiberglass steps there to go out through the center. And then right over here on the side of this seat, we've got more steps. So if you wanna just walk down the gunnel, you can. Moving forward at the helm, we see we've got our throttle controls right here, tilt steering, all of our rocker switches are within easy reach right there. And then you've got your trim gauges on this side, very important stereo control there, windlass and spotlights right there. At our top level up here, All of our operational gauges, miles per hour, engine operating temps, voltmeter, RPM. This is a great feature. We have an engine sink so we can balance out of our engines right there. Above, we have a relatively new VHF radio and we have our radar unit stored right there. This gives us a view of the helm. I was driving this boat, this is what I would see. Quick circle behind us, gives us an overview of the cockpit. Engine access is right up under those seats, tilts up. There's more storage up under those seats also. Let's go inside.
We enter the cabin through the center line sliding door and down a few steps. Immediately inside, we have a large head, which is unusual for this size boat. It's all fully lined fiberglass, easy to care for, easy to clean, lots of counter space, little mirror with medicine cabinet, and then the pull-out RV style shower right there. Moving along, we've got our refrigerator. Nice and clean. And then our galley is right here. We've got a Corian style countertop, dual burner glass top, stove, microwave, storage. And this is nice right here. Built in drawers for all of our stuff. Back in 2000, this TV was state of the art along with the VHF player, and today it's not. Our power panel is right here. We've got our 12 volt side right here. We don't have our shore power connected. Generator start here, 12 volt service right here. Air conditioning thermostat there. Circling forward, we see we've got a nice large V-berth, full beam there. And on the diagonal, it's probably six and a half feet. Larson's done a very nice job with the fit and finish on this boat. We've got nice vinyl, light wood finish. Our sofa here has an ultra leather vinyl and our table and countertops are of the Corian style. Notice we even have a nice little wood inset right there. This table here also has a lower leg and a cushion so that it becomes a sleeping area also. Gunnel storage above, and we have our, our stereo there also. Circling back, we've got a hanging locker. And right here, we have an open mid berth, full beam, has a, its own window for light and air, and of course, a privacy curtain. This Larson 290 Cabriolet is in very nice condition, neat, clean, odor-free, operationally sound, ready to go for the season. Viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts.